Chad Wolf is the former acting director of the Department of Homeland Security. He joins us now from El Paso. Welcome, Chad. You know, I, I'm looking at the images behind you. You and I worked together in the Trump administration. I remember you come over to the White House. We had a competent president who worked to fix the border and with great success he did, you did, as Department of Homeland Security Secretary. And now I'm looking, you're in El Paso. What are you seeing on the streets? I, I think I'm seeing illegal immigrants just behind you. Well, absolutely. We're here at uh, a Catholic church. This is where a lot of the folks here in El Paso, as they cross over and they come into different shelters, uh, the shelters are overrun, obviously, so they're out on the streets. They're sleeping on the streets here in the alley and, and elsewhere. We're on the. We're just a little over 24 hours from uh, the uh, Title 42 ending, and so you're going to see more and more individuals coming across that border because, as you indicated, the Biden administration is not really interested in solving this crisis. To solve it is to mean to bring it to a close, bring some deterrence back into the system. Instead, they simply are trying to manage this. They're trying to process more and more of these individuals into the country every single day and every single week. And so you're on the eve of Title 42. There's already a crisis here in El Paso and other places along that border. But come Thursday at midnight, you're going to see even more individuals coming, mainly single adults and mainly males. Those have been the, the population that the Biden administration under Title 42 have been able to push back into Mexico. You won't be able to do that anymore. Instead, they're going to be released into American mm -hmm. communities all across this country.